Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching guys how to share a QR code generated by Kahoot from scratch. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first place that you guys would want to be in is uh, the Kahoot interface, which is here, as you can see. And to actually share a QR code is quite simple. Now, if you guys are on the app, all you have to do is simply open the app and basically follow the on screen instructions as shown here. So um, as it says, so you guys would first want to open Kahoot's detail page and click on the ellipses or the three vertical lines um, next to the interface on the dashboard. So it looks a little something like this. So to show you guys what I mean, let's actually zoom in here. Here's a little GIF. So you click on the three dots and you'll see that there's an option to copy the link for it. Now, um, you're going to simply do that, copy it. Let me actually zoom out real quick. And when you go to click on Share Kahoot and copy the link, you should have the option to share it as a QR code. And to show you guys what I mean, if you were to click on a library, it would pull up a list of all of the QR codes or links that are tied to your Kahoot account that are tied to your account. So when you click on library, and click on, uh, you'll be met with four different tabs being recent, drafts, favorites, and shared with you. Now, shared with you is what you want to opt for here. And you should have the option when you go to edit it to share as a QR code. Now, um, to actually do it, it's quite simple. You guys want to copy the link, like I said, and you'd want to go to this website right here, qrfi.com. And um, you would want to select um, from the list of formats here, website. So it's this one right here. And uh, from the uh, Kahoot link that we just copied, we're going to paste it here and generate a QR code using this tool online. So what's going to happen is um, once you paste the link here, it's going to create a code for you or a QR code with um, the configuration made by you. So you can select the layout, the style, and whatever, and you guys should be done. And that's honestly all there is to it. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.